We will now start going through the target organ approach with the DH view. As you will see on the cartoon in the upper right hand corner that the DH view is located in the subxiphoid region and we go in an order from there to the SR view to the systocolic view to the home run view. Since I like baseball we're basically going round the horn or round the bases however in a backward direction. On the DH view what is classically obtained is the gallbladder kissing the diaphragm. So you can see here as I draw the cursor around the gallbladder that it is kissing this other bright hyperechoic line which is the diaphragm. And we can look into the pleural space with this type of depth. Here this patient is positive as you can see a liver lobe and these anechoic black triangles. Anechoic black triangles are the easily recognizable ultrasonographic findings in fast exams for free fluid. Here we are at the DH view. Notice this dog is shaved just to better show you landmarks. However, in most cases, shaving is unnecessary for adequate imaging during AFAST exams. To start with the DH view, the probe is placed at the subxiphoid area. And in that region, what is imaged is the gallbladder kissing the diaphragm, as shown here. Once that landmark is achieved sonographically, then we fan through liver lobes towards the tabletop and away from the tabletop looking for free fluid. This dog is negative. To start with the DH view, the probe is placed at the subxiphoid area. And in that region, what is imaged is the gallbladder kissing the diaphragm as shown here. Once that landmark is achieved sonographically, then we fan through liver lobes towards the tabletop and away from the tabletop looking for free fluid. This dog is negative. 